everybody, it's Big E. Um, this is going to be the review of my Ball Engineer uh, Master 2 Telemeter. Uh, the model of this watch is a CM1020 C L2J BKWH. This watch is pretty cool because um, it's a Singapore. A Malaysia only watch. It has a uh, 63 uh, tritium tubes, um, one on the telemeter second hand, and one on the hour hand, and one on the minute hand. It has a sign crowned uh, screw down pushers. And um, things about telemetry is one thing about a telemetry, uh, telemeter is, is that it's used to uh, measure. Uh, distance by, by uh, sound so uh, it measures uh, the time taken for sound to travel from one area uh, to the listener and it's you know especially uh, nice for like in a warfare type area this um watch is anti-magnetic it has a Faraday cage uh, it has a chronograph it's made of 904 steel. The strap is real nice and supple. It's leather. It's a 20 uh, mil strap. The case is 16 mils. And um, it's it's a really nice watch. I like the printing on the back with the railroad um, train on there. And it, you can see it says anti-magnetic Swiss made. And this thing is about five times the magnetic resistance of a Rolex mill gauss. Um, it's powered inside there by a 7750 Valjo chronograph and it's running chronometer specs. It's a 41 millimeter case. It's water resistant to 100 meters or 330 feet. Um, it has a sapphire crystal. This buckle is like a tow truck anchor actually it has a sign buckle it's really nice um, I, I just like it it's, it's a real unique watch and you're not going to see this watch uh, with many with many people the watch is rather kind of thick the um, case it is a 16 millimeter case but it has a super luminova Arabic numbers and it also has uh, tritium tubes uh, which is like the night sights on a gun, basically. It, it glows for about 20 years. The list price of this watch is $2,899. And it, it's just a really, really nice watch. I mean, it has a, uh, what do you call that? Um, Anti-reflective sapphire crystal, a 45-hour power reserve, um, the date window, it's a dual box day date uh, window. If you can see that, it's real nice. It has a 30 minute uh, sub dial on the top, and then it has a 12 hour sub dial on the bottom. Let me check that out a little better there. And the crown is has a real nice uh, uh, grip on there on all the crowns. The screw down crowns and the main crown is screwed down also. And this watch is probably the nicest watch I want to be honest I ever had. It's super nice. I really love it. Um, some other things about the watch. It's uh, Malaysia. I mean Singapore and Malaysia only. Uh, try to take a look at the uh, night shot here. Tritium, you eyes need to be adjusted to it, but um, I'll give it a blast of light so you can see the superluminova on the Arabic numbers. And as far as I know, no one's ever reviewed or shown any one of these watches on YouTube. This is the only one, I believe, the only video ever. And so, once once the uh, your light eyes adjust, I'll drop some pictures in too. You'll you'll see that it really glows like a flashlight. The tritium glows all night. It, it's really 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 nice. And being a Valjo 7750, you do have the Valjo 7750 rotor wobble, but that's okay. I really kind of like that. And 
it's it's really a legible watch. So that's my review of the Ball Engineer Master Two Telemeter. Um, if you've ever seen one one of these or anything, pick one up. It's a really rare watch, as far as I know. And leave a comment and please subscribe. This is Biggie. I'm